Hey guys, welcome to a much way too early NFL predictions where we're going to be predicting game, uh, weeks number 11 and 12 every game. We're also going to open up a playoff football, uh, hoping for the Mac Jones party to continue. That would be absolutely amazing if it did. Um, also, I just wanted to uh, talk about the recent developments in the newly formed CBE. You know, forget about AEW, we've got the CBE, baby. And right now, Cole has created the CWO, which is which is a faction. It is the Card World Order. And it consists of some awesome channels. But, you know, we're going to take them down. So there's going to be the inaugural tournament. There's already been a couple matchups already discussed about this. I did lose to Sticks G, uh, but it was very unfair. I'm like, he had 11 packs. I had 7 packs. I only had 28 cards. He had over 100. So really, I had no chance. I had no chance. So so the very first round is going to be me versus Sticks. And uh, yeah, I'm going to be coming out firing Sticks. So you better, you better be on your A game. Last night, we also had... Um, a battle between Raven Rips and Rip Em All. Raven Rips with an amazing, I'll tell you this right now, she had an amazing promo and she came out and her cards were pretty dang amazing as well. She had the victory. Um, but Rip Em All, we'll get them next time, Rip. We will get them next time. But wait for the tournament. You know, there's gonna be some. There's gonna be interesting things coming up. There's gonna be tag team matchups. There's gonna be live events. There's gonna be premiered events. All kinds of stuff coming up. And uh, you know, just stay tuned. All right. So let's predict week number eleven. Week number eleven is gonna start November seventeenth, which is a Thursday, and it's between the Titans versus the Packers. It's it is the squad leader. Tennessee Titans versus Sticks G and the Green Bay Packers. I'm going to pick the Titans to win this. They're going to need this one. And uh, we're going to have Aaron Rodgers' number, you know, and he's going to be going down. He's going to be hitting the ground hard all day long. You better believe it. So Titans beat the Packers. The next game is the Bears versus the Falcons. I'm going to pick, I'm going to pick the Bears to win this one. Uh, Justin Fields, I think, is going to be... He's going to be ready to play, and uh, he'll, he'll, he'll be fine. Uh, the Eagles versus the Colts. I'm going to pick the Colts to win this game. I think the Colts, are, at this point in time, is going to need to start winning, and uh, this is a very important game for them and to make a playoff hunt, and uh, I think, and, and possibly to win that number one seed over Tennessee. We, they're going to have to win, so they're going to beat the Eagles in this one. Uh, the Jets versus the Patriots, I think it's going this is going to be a closer game than people think. I'm still going to give it to the Patriots, but it's still going to be pretty good. Now we got the Commanders versus the Texans. I'm going to pick the Commanders to win this. I think, uh, yeah, I think uh, Carson Wentz is going to come out just firing, and he'll be, he'll be all right as the Commanders uh, quarterback. We've got the Rams versus the Saints. Rams win. Um, defending champs. Saints are going to go through a little... Um, yeah, yeah, the, the 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 Saints are going to go through a little rebuilding period, and uh, yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. Uh, the Browns versus the Bills. We don't know what's going to happen with the Browns. I'm like the Browns are seem to be um um in, so, ha, might have some issues if uh, if uh, if uh, their quarterback is suspended for the year. I'm like so I'm I'm picking the Bills to win this one. Uh, Panthers versus the Ravens. We got Raven Rips as Ravens here. I'm gonna pick the Ravens to win this one. Um, I think they'll destroy the Panthers. All right, we've got the Lions versus the Giants. I'm gonna pick the Lions. Cool. I'm picking your boys to win this game. Uh, Raiders versus Broncos. This this is gonna be a good game. This is gonna be one of the games to watch out for. I'm gonna pick the Broncos to win. The next one is in the division as well. It's the Chiefs versus the Chargers. Another very good game. I think the Chiefs will end up winning that one. And then we got the Cowboys versus Julie Farnham's Vikings. I'm going to pick the Vikings to win this one. They will beat the Dallas Cowboys. The Sunday Nighters, the Bengals versus Steelers. I'm going to pick the Bengals. And the Monday Nighter is going to be a good one. It's the Niners versus the Cardinals. I'm picking the Cardinals to beat the Niners. Week 12 is exciting because it's Thanksgiving in the States. Uh, we're going to start off with the Bills versus Lions. Um, 
Cole, I, I, unfortunately, I'm not going to give you two. Oh, you know what? It's it's five days. It's going to be in it's going to be in Detroit. You know what, Cole? I'm going to give you this victory here. The Lions are going to come out and upset the Bills. The second game in this Thanksgiving um, Thursday is the Giants versus the Cowboys. I'm going to pick the Cowboys to win this one. And then we got the Patriots versus the Vikings. I'm going to be picking the Vikings to win this, even though I think the Patriots will be ready to play. Uh, the, the first game on Thursday, on Sunday is the Texans versus the Dolphins. I'm going to pick the Miami Dolphins. Two is going to be a lot better this year, and the Dolphins are going to win. The next game is the Bengals versus the Titans. Uh, the Titans are going to be pretty ticked off. They got revenge in order. Titans beat the Bengals. Uh, the Broncos versus the Panthers. The Broncos will dominate this game, probably win by 14. Uh, the Bears versus the Jets. I think the Bears are going to come out and they're going to win. Um, the next game is the Falcons versus the Commanders. The Commanders, I think, is going to beat the, Fal the um, Falcons. The Buccaneers versus the Browns. I think the Bucks will come out and beat the Browns. We've got the... What did I write here? I can't see. Um, oh, my goodness gracious. My writing is... Oh, the Ravens versus the Jags. I'm going to pick the Ravens to win this one. They'll destroy the Jaguars, probably. We got the Raiders versus the Seahawks. I'm going to pick the Raiders to win that one. Uh, Chargers versus Cardinals. I'm going to pick the Chargers to beat the Cardinals. The Saints versus Niners. I'm going to pick the 49ers. We got the Rams versus the Chiefs. This is probably going to be the game of the week right here. I'm going to pick the um, eh, I'm going to pick the Rams to win that one. The Sunday Nighter is the um, Packers versus the... Uh, I don't know. Who are they playing against? I have no idea. The Packers are going to win. Uh, the Monday Nighter is the Steelers. Oh, the Packers versus the Eagles. The Packers are going to win. Steelers versus Colts. I'm going to pick the Colts to win that one. All right. So we're going to open up some playoff football. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see what we're going to open up. Let's see. hopefully we open up a Mac Jones. You know, continue the Mac Jones party. So we get a ton of cards here. So let's do this and uh, let's start a looking. All right, so we're gonna start off with Jarvis Landry, Mike Williams of the Chargers, Whitney Merciless. He is a merciless. Oh, nice. We got a Dan Marino from the Dolphins. Very nice. We got a Ryan Tannehill from the Titans. Very nice. We got a Max Crosby. It's become a very good defensive end for the Raiders. Ooh. Uh, Jerome Bettis, that's a nice one. I don't think I've got that one yet. Devontae Parker. C.J. Henderson, a very good cornerback. Nice. Joe Namath for the Jets. Patty Mahomes. We got Odell Beckham Jr., awesome wide receiver. We got another great wide receiver, Keenan Allen. David Johnson. Xavier Howard. All right, so let's, oh, no, let's see. Let's, let's not show anything there. All right, we got Fred Warner, the San Francisco uh, <laughs> San Francisco 49ers linebacker. We got Brian Dawkins, a Hall of Famer there. Warren Sapp, another one. Oh, we got a first, is that a rook? No, it's not. Tyrell Williams of the Lions. There we go, Cole. Uh, Brandon Ayuk, Dalvin Cook, Demarcus Lawrence. We got a Jameis Winston, Logan Thomas. Chase Emmons, Romeo Cora. Nice. We got a DJ Moore, awesome receiver. Uh, Fletcher Cox, who does not play for the Eagles anymore. Devin White, one of the best linebackers in the league. Jared Goff for the Detroit Lions. There we go. Uh, we've got our first rookie card, and it is a Joe Tyron uh, Shoyinka. He's, he's supposed to be a decent linebacker. He's a first rounder. So we'll see how he does. Nice. We got another Elijah Moore. I like this kid. He's, of course, from um, Ole Miss. We got a Joseph Osai. We got another Anthony Swartz. I have a ton of him. Uh, that's our first uh, Kylan Granson, tight end of the Colts. All right, let's see. Okay, so th this is the kid reporter. We don't need it. Uh, we got a Seth Williams. Very nice. That's a kickoff rookie card. We got another Joe Tyron Shoyinka kickoff rookie card. Ooh, nice. We got a Chad Johnson. All right, let's see what this one is. Looks like Bengals. 
If it's a rookie card, it is a good one, and it is a good one. Look at this one, guys. It is a uh, behind the numbers of Jamar Chase. That is a beauty. Let's see what's see. Oh, it's a dolphin. A call to arms of Tua. There we go. That's two very nice cards. That's the second year card of Tua. And we got a very nice rookie card of Jamar Chase. This kid is unbelievable. We'll leave those for the hits. All right. So I don't think that we're done yet. I think we got to open up a little more football. We're going to open up some Panini Prism. So let's rip this open if I can. I forgot the scissors. Oh, but I got it. I got it. Don't worry. All right. So I think there's only 20 cards here. So 20 cards. Um, unwrap four hanger box exclusive red ice prisms. Uh, let's see what else. So find one a retail exclusive green prism. So we should get two red ice prisms and a and a green prism. And let's see. Look for hanger box exclusive rookie variation silver prisms. All right. Whew. Okay. So let's see what we're gonna get here. Let's hope for something. Let's hope for something big here. Let's hope for one of the big rookies. Maybe Mac Jones will come out. Party with us again. Party like it's 1999. All right, super excited. This is the first time opening up some good old Prism. And we're starting off with Chase Edmonds, who's now the running back for the Miami Dolphins. These cards feel beautiful. We got a Laramie Tunsil. We got a Will Disley of the Seattle Seahawks. We got a Devin McCourty of the New England Patriots. We got, oh, nice. We got a Marshall Falk of the Indianapolis Colts. He was a good one. Uh, Chris Hearn on the fourth just hasn't been able to, you know, lots of potential as a uh, tight end. Just has not, has not been able to do it. We got James Robinson. We got Leonard Floyd, a good linebacker. Nice. We got Derrick Henry. There we go. That's a Tennessee Titan. Let's go. Uh, we got a Tony Baselli of the Jacksonville Jaguars. He was a good one. Boom. There we go. Tony Baselli. There we go. Cool. We got a Jared Goff. That's a nice one. Vaughn Miller. We got a Darnell Mooney second year card. We got a Chase Young second year card. We got a Avante Maddox Philadelphia Eagles. Hollywood Marquise Hollywood Brown. We got a Blake Jerwin. Okay, let's see. It looks like it's our first rookie card. And it is F. Zavine Collins of the Arizona Cardinals. Okay, so our first green. Oh, oh no, I think I wasted it. And it is a Carson Wentz. All right. All right. Not the rookie that we're looking for, but he's not even a rookie. So, okay. Oh, rookie card. Rookie card. Is that, is that, oh, who, oh, is it? No, no, no. I thought it was someone else. Okay. It's, it's still a nice one. We got a Terrace Marshall Jr. I like, I like this kid. I think this kid should be pretty decent. Uh, look at the shiny shine, eh? All right, let's see. Okay, let's, so we have to go this way. This is our first orange. And it looks like it's a, the Jets. Does not look like the quarterback. It is uh, Chris Herndon, uh, the fourth. That's all right. So this is our red prisms. Oh, Green Bay Packers. There we go. Mr. Sticks G. There's an A.J. Dillon. Very nice. Let's see. Oh, we got a Matt Ryan. That's a nice one. And let's see. Hopefully, let's see if it's okay. It's a rookie. It's a rookie. Okay, let's see. Who's it going to be? Is it a quarterback? No, it's not. It looks like Tommy Tremble. Okay. That's still, he still has potential. He's a tight end for the Carolina Panthers. Um, very nice cards. Love these cards. All right, so I think I have to go this way. Let's see. These are, oh, we got a hype card. Denver Broncos. Who can, who is it? 
And we have Jerry Judy. There we go. We got a hype of Jerry Judy. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Not not not, not the best box, but uh, no, we got some nice ones here. All right. I'm like, if, if anything, I think the playoff, we might have did better because we got a Jamar Chase um, behind the numbers and a call to arms of Tua, which are very nice. And then for Prism, we got a Carson Wentz green. Uh, I didn't even look to see if they're numbered. I'm not sure if they are, but we got a... Uh, Terrace Marshall Jr. I did this is probably the best rookie that we got. Uh, and you know, I actually like Terrace Marshall Jr. We got a um, red ice prism of a uh, Matt Ryan, AJ Dillon, Chris Hurd on the fourth, and the rookie is Tommy Trumbull. And we got a hype. We're gonna hype this up. We're gonna hype up the CBE, baby. We're gonna hype it up. And yes, it, this is a Jerry Judy, but in the, in the CBE, hey. Can you imagine? Imagine the CBE opening up CBE cards, baby. I'm like, that would be, that'd be awesome. And whoever rips, like there could be a one of one squad leader. Everyone's gonna want it. It'll be a million dollar card. That's gonna be the one that everyone's gonna wanna rip. And uh, you know, hey, stay tuned. You might see stuff like that. All right, so remember to subscribe to the Cali and Joy Squad. Hit that notification button so don't miss out on any of our videos. Smash that thumbs up button. And share it for our friends. Until next time, peace out.